I believe in a world that would consider that everything and everyone is connected, not only uh, between human beings, but also with other plants, with, uh, with other elements, with the air, with the earth, with the water. So I believe in a world, better world that thinks that is connected. I am someone who really believes in biophilia, which is a human's love of and connection to nature. And I think through those connections to nature, whether it's incorporated into the built environment or just something that you experience in your daily life is uh, positive for your health, it can open up a space for a positive learning environment and then also contribute to what ITJ holds most dearly, which is happiness. The values behind sustainability are actually rooted in very old thinking about how we should be using fewer resources, wasting less, and keeping people and communities healthy. Instituto Thomas Jefferson is a very special organization, a very special school. But one of the things that we appreciate the most about ITJ is their commitment to nurture a student's health, happiness, and success. And so a lot of the changes that we make to ITJ are structural, they're environmental, they're policy-oriented. But the culture of the school already supports an, a whole school sustainability approach. To create a culture uh, within all the students, teachers, staff, and then go beyond as well and create this uh, sustainable culture with parents and the community. It's about each person at ITJ making a commitment to sustainable values and demonstrating those commitments day after day. Only through that kind of commitment that happens across the entire school body will we actually see a true culture of sustainability take root and survive into the future. The, the students that are being educated here at ITJ clearly will have an impact on their future uh, and the future of their communities and the future of their country. We will try to include the, the students helping us with sustainable practices, policies, uh, based data about water, energy and waste consumption. I think that the hugest challenge is uh, to make sure that people have the chance and the opportunity uh, to live a sustainable education experience since they are little and throughout all their lifetime. We are working with the students, K-12 to students, so they are the future of our planet. We are teaching them how to save it, how to uh, work with the sustainable practices. Well, the school and the house are completely interconnected. And as we in the planet with nature and animals are all interconnected. A sustainable school is striving for results that have to do with how it is impacting the natural environment. Also how it is impacting the health of the, of the people inside that school, whether it is having a positive impact and uh, a result around how literate those students are in environmental concepts. To get there, to get to those results, there uh, is a, a framework, a system that we use with schools called Whole School Sustainability. Where we have to work in innovation is in our educational system. We need to figure it out what is the best way that students can, as I mentioned, have this idea of sustainability like a chip. The most important thing for whole school sustainability framework to work in a school or institution is the collaboration between the different areas of whole school sustainability. Educational program, organizational culture and physical place have to work together. The role of a physical place in whole school sustainability is uh, that we want to create a space where the built environment and the occupants uh, can interact with the 
with the sustainable and healthy practices. The sustainable intelligence, the students will have the capacity to make better choices. By introducing whole school sustainability framework into a school or institution, is we're caring about the three P's, people, planet, and prosperity. We are educating people in order for them to take care of their planet, in order for them to be able to prosper in a sustainable way. Education for sustainability is a must nowadays because we are looking towards the future. We are trying to see a future for everybody. We have to interact with all these species because we, we belong to just one planet. And, and we have to, to set our minds that this is the only way we can survive. In order to build a sustainable culture, it's important to think about sustainability not, not as a success, but as a reward, that you're doing something good for yourself and for the future generations. And it is more about how you grow the culture and you grow the ability of that school to accomplish those goals. So we are educating a new generation of students that care about the future. In a lot of ways, ITJ is already embodying a lot of the characteristics of whole school sustainability. They employ catalytic communication. The leadership efforts for the school are driven by students. I really like this project because I believe in it. It's, it's the possibility to make changes. It's a possibility to, as a human, have a, a healthy life, a style of life, to be better, to share, to recognize the importance that our actions affect the rest of the world. There are always solutions for this world. This world is full of possibilities. You know, as, as we are alive, we have choices, we have opportunities.